A welcome return to the war on Sunday as the quest for the first turn, first try, battle, victory, streak, whatever the heck you call it, continues. The Battle of Nagashino, 1575. The Battle of Nagashino, 1575, saw the defeat of Takeda Katsuyori's fearsome cavalry by Tokugawa Ieyasu and Oda Nobunaga. The latter defeating the mighty Takeda cavalry charge by unleashing a volley of matchlock fire from behind stockades. I feel like the flavor text is diminished in this game. We used to have entire sections dedicated to the history, characters, events. It's like one paragraph. Game on. It is June 1575, and Nagashino Castle in Mikawa province is under attack. After an incursion deep into Tokugawa territory failed, Takeda Katsuyori led his army back into the mountains and now besieges the fortress at Nagashino. He can count among his forces the fearsome Takeda cavalry, known to be the finest in Japan. The young Takeda warlord is keen to be successful in his attack on Nagashino after the failure of his raid so far. However, Word has now reached Tokugawa years that his castle is under attack. The Tokugawa are not without powerful friends. Oda Nobunaga, the foremost warlord in central Japan, has brought his army to relieve the siege. Among his army are his many matchlock gunners. Nobunaga means to deploy these gunners behind wooden palisades alongside regular infantry, all to protect them from the Takeda cavalry. However, Nobunaga knows that his defensive position is unlikely to save the Nagashino garrison. He has sent a flanking army into the hills to the south. Once the Takeda are defeated at the palisades, the flanking force will be able to relieve the castle. The order, therefore, have two battles to win. They must repel the Takeda cavalry at their defensive line and also relieve Nagashino Castle before it falls. Two battles for the price of one. Advancing. Don't Soon mind if we do. Will be upon us. We must defend the palisades. We shall defend them indeed. In order to do that, we're going to get these. Are these specials? No, these are just Yariashigaru. Why aren't they the... Oh, I've forgotten the name of them. The uh, older ones have, like, extra special Yariashigaru. They're using basic rubbish. I mean, it's still going to trounce their calf, but it'd be nice. <laughs> Either way, we've got two matches to win. Most of this is cavalry, a little bit of Ashigaru. Oh, Yari, thankfully. Let them come in, get absolutely shredded. None of you can take a knee. Interesting. Uh, absolutely shredded by the matchlocks. We'll send in the Yaris to hold them, and then Katanas can basically just finish the job. You know what? Just go just behind. That way you don't get any of the negatives. We aren't counted as, like, interrupting them or going too far in front. That's it. Run into the stakes, come into the gaps, and get shredded. Excellent. Alright, I'm actually going to send one unit non yarried so they're not in the proper wall. They're just going to go forward and destroy. That's what they do. Excellent. In fact, you know what? You can probably come off as well. You just swarm. Take care of all of this cavalry. Back. Oh, they're storming over the bridge. Right, that's something to worry about. Go on, let's grab this unit. Let's get the samurai moving forward. We're going to need something to hold up and just basically annihilate. Flip neck. This Ashigaru unit, who apparently is getting shredded anyway just by, just by the samurai. Do I need to do anything in this match? <laughs> like, do I actually need to do anything? All them destroyed. Let's see if we can get round the back. Actually, no. Let's send one unit up here. 
We send the second unit round the back. Excellent. They all got absolutely minced. Push forward. Let's take you off, Yari Wall. And we do have new units advancing. So let's leave some of this back here. Keep them behind the old stakes. Oh ho. That's a lot of units advancing. Right, we lost a fair chunk of the matchlock samurai from one of the units up top, but the rest of them seem to be doing pretty darn good. We haven't even moved. Potion <laughs> haven't used any of their abilities, so it's like, they're fine. They're fine. Excellent. Right, this unit's a little bit rinsed, but as long as nothing too much comes around here, which looks like there won't be, the enemy's going to attack us from the front, and we can just... We can annihilate that. That's fine. Right, pull back. Pull back over here, my friend. You will be needed. Not right now. Excellent. Yari Walla. Oh, you got rinsed. Yeah, that was my bad. Actually gonna bring them all the way up front so they can get some shots into the back line. Keep moving. Hold up all these units, let the match lock just decimate stuff. Give them a bit of a boost, improve their accuracy. Crack it in the back, my friend. Yeah, because this unit's gonna get a little bit riddled. If we can pull back the Yariashi Garu, they can Basically, just take the chance. Bit of a breather, more than anything else. Where are you pushing? Where are you pushing? Are you going to come over here? Because then I have to leave that unit there. <laughs> That's all this comes down to. Right, we're going to take a bit of a gamble. We're going to push him forward. Holy smokes. Okay, Oda got hit. Where the hell did this come from? Great. <laughs> <laughs> Aye, let's grab Oda Nobunaga, pull him back. Hold firm. We are winning the fight. Actually, um, you know what? You, you keep running that way. Pull you guys back. Pull you out. Hit, but not destroyed. What is that? Yari Cavalry? Yeah, just, just go shred the cavalry. I'm pretty sure one unit... Probably shouldn't risk it. But one unit on its own is kind of all you need, to be absolutely honest. Just because it's Yari versus cavalry. <laughs> oh, thankfully it's not Yari... Yari Samurai. They, they would struggle. Right. Get you running on. Sorry, my friends. You will be injured. Yeah, that's going to take a bit of damage onto the match locks. The plus side, it looks like you can genuinely mess up most of this battle, and it, it just doesn't matter. Because <laughs> most of their forces are already gone. What's remaining? Got some Yaris, Takada themselves. Boashigeru and some samurai, right. Samurai could be a little bit tricksy. Still nothing major. Excellent. See the cavalry fleeing. You can shoot whenever you want. What happens when you don't shoot? You get charged. It's worth chasing them. Let's just leave the match. They'll be fine. There we go. All right, first battle won. Time to relieve the forces. Tore me the castle. Now is the time to aid the garrison. Oh. 
Flanking forces in position. Let us come forth. Oh wait, do we not actually get to control them? Oh yes, we do. Oh ho ho ho. Right, Oda, you come chill there. We're gonna grab all of these. They're just gonna shoot over the top. <laughs> do a little bit of decimation. Let's grab... Yep, yeah, Yaris. We're going to hold them in reserve because we're basically expecting the enemy to rush over to us. But if we can get everything bottlenecking over here, then our flanking force will just be able to rinse all the way through. Particularly as it's Katana. Katana versus Yari. Oda was no fool. Or I was a little bit of a fool who left his rear completely exposed. And I'm actually going to have to pay attention now because... Um, Nine is not a good retinue, but it's adequate. It did the job. All right, let's get them charging over now. Because uh, the front line is basically in position, so we can swarm these guys from all angles. They're already committing most of their katanas onto the wall. Not a good idea. Although then again, these are Yari Ashigaru and they're not even gonna put them into Yari wall. Gonna shoot? There you go. Oh, that is water. Like that is that is actual passable terrain. Right, come over here, my friend. I'm gonna use two of you. Just put a big old wedge there. <laughs> Just set it right in front. Excellent. Like the tiniest bit of a hill. It's technically a hill. I'm counting it. Samurai and just for a bit of extra glory. We're gonna set these guys up. So we're gonna bottleneck one side. Right, we got samurai coming in the front and some Yari wall. We're gonna try and get this second unit of katana coming in the little bit of a flank. You go hit this Yaris. How are we doing over here? Right, push, push, push. Katanas. Not katanas. These are matchlock. Oh, it's matchlock samurai. Ah, they went for the boost. Do we? We do. We have bonsai. Oh, oh. Doesn't do a heck of a lot, but it definitely does something. Right, let's commit this unit as well. Looks like we need a little something extra just to burst through, because we need to get into the back of the rest of them. Oh my days, they broke one of us. Come over here, give us a little bit of a boost. It's 3v1, and we are still struggling. <laughs> Excellent. That's what we like to see. Right, looks like all of this is starting to crack. I think everything's breaking. We just have to go take on Takeda. Maybe we don't. Sweet. <laughs> Mate, I was just gearing up for the final battle. This was going to be a challenge. We were going to fight in the middle. Why did you run? It's the only issue I have with the historical battles. Like, you gear up. It feels like it's building. The anticipation is there. And then you win. <laughs> Bugger. All right, well, I guess that will have to be it for the war on Sunday. And, um, Takeda. I don't know why anyone's scared of them. That was not a big deal. They even managed to outmaneuver us. And we still won. Oh, well, fingers crossed. The next match will be a challenge. Maybe some uh, actual... Combat will be involved. Or we'll just continue this first try streak. I'm enjoying it either way. It's a nice break from Rome 2. <laughs> I, with all that said, thank you very much for tuning in. And until next time, of course, as always, peace out. The Takeda have been swept from the field and are fleeing to the mountains. The siege is broken. A glorious victory.